Hello friends, welcome. Uh, in this video, I'm going to start a new mini series about Laravel and Spati Media Library package. Okay, so if you search for Laravel Media Library uh, from Spati, you can go to the spati.b and here you can find all the open source packages and go and find the Laravel Media Library. Okay, here we have the introduction for that. I have created this fresh Laravel 9 application and it's Laravel 9.8 uh, right now. So let's go and install the package. So here we have this command composer show Spati Laravel media library to show what the version. Here we have the version 10 right now. And here we have the introduction. Let's go to the base installation. And we need to run the composer, require Spati Laravel Media Library. And right now we have the version 10. So let's copy this command. Go to the terminal. I am CD in the project. So I'm going to paste that command in and hit enter. Okay, next, now this is the free version but also the Laravel, the Spati has the pro version which is more, uh, has more features but we are going to use the free version. So preparing the database, let's run the PHP Artisan vendor published. Okay, and we need to run the PHP Artisan Migrate. Okay, so let's open the table class and create the database with a media name because if I open the .env file, we are in the media app. And uh, here in the database we have media by default, the name of the project. So let's go here and I'm going to make a new connection for MySQL. Okay, and create new database. Name it media. Okay, open this media. And now let's run the PHP artisan migrate. Okay. After the PHP artisan migrate, We need to run the PHP config, vendor publish for config. And here is the default uh, config file, which has a disk name. If we want to override that, we can add this media disk in the .env file. By default has the public directory. And you have the max file size, Q name, and all that things, but we are not going to touch right now. Now, if you go to the basic usage and prepare your model, here we have the model, and we need to implement the has media and also use interacts with media. So for that, I'm going to create a post model and migration. So to interact the post with media. So let's go here and artisan, PHP artisan, make model, I'm going to say post dash M for migration.
Okay, let's open the post table here. And what I'm going to add, I'm going to add only the title, so string for the title and the body. Don't assign table. Uh, this is going to be text. And let's save it. Now go and run again the php artisan migrate okay and if i refresh we have media here and also we have the post table now that's it for this video in the next video we are going to see how we can uh, work with spotty media library upload images and uh, use the post model for that. So see you in the next one. All the best.